My name is uh, Senator Richard Martinez. I represent uh, District 5, which encumbers Rio Riba, Los Alamos, and Sandoval counties. Asking me if I, if I uh, noted uh, that we have a lot of stress in our community. And uh, prior to being a senator, I also served 14 years as a magistrate judge for Rio Riba County. And I know that we have a lot of stress in our community, especially when we've got individuals that, uh, that are unemployed, that can't find jobs, that, uh, that are under the influence of uh, narcotic drugs. Uh, they're trying to release themselves from, from this, uh, this uh, snake that has them. And, and, they, and they can, so they go, they're undergo a lot of stress. Uh, I think unemployment in our community is one of, the, uh, one of the highest stress levels that a person can have. And I've noticed that, uh, in, uh, that recently it seems like our young generation, the youth, um, that is one of the main words that they're always using. I'm so stressed, I'm so stressed. And it seems that before when we were growing up, we didn't have the stress that they have. But I guess uh, a lot of the stress that, that maybe young kids might have too is maybe the financial burdens. Uh, the, the cell phones, the uh, vehicles, everybody wants to keep up with the Joneses, everybody has uh, the needs that, uh, that uh, they can't, uh, that they're competing for. I think that's added stress uh, to a lot of the, the kids that we have within our community. Do you feel that there's an increased pressure on our first responders because of the rising levels of stress? Oh, I, I agree that we have a lot of uh, uh, stress, level, high stress level on first responders like in police officers, firemen, uh, uh, ambulance workers. Uh, I think the 9-11 case uh, uh, clearly shows that, uh, that these are very stressful positions. Uh, I think um, even uh, postal workers, I mean, there's so much stress within our community and I think that first, uh, first responders are probably the, uh, the people that are, that are taking on that stress. I also uh, was fortunate in the early 70s to have worked with the uh, Espanola Police Department. I didn't myself work as a police officer, but I worked uh, as as uh, as uh, uh, I worked with directly with the, the police department and the officers, and I saw a lot of the stress uh, that officers uh, go through, especially when uh, when they see uh, uh, traumatic deaths and and, uh, and and incidents of that nature. Um, I think it, it's very hard for them to cope with that. Our meditation, do you feel like this could have a positive application to alleviating and helping to decrease the stress levels with people in these very intense work environments? I think that yoga would probably be great uh, for people, uh, first, uh, first responders, to help them cope with it. I know that, uh, that uh, your community has offered uh, I think these, uh, some of these uh, 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 class, classroom uh, techniques to, to some of my, wife, my wife's uh, students at Los Ninos Kindergarten, and I think that it's worked out beautiful. I think that, it's, uh, I, I think that this is one of the things that, uh, that we need uh, more in our community is to be able to, to meditate and, and to uh, relax our bodies and our minds and to be able to, to let... Uh, some of that stress level flow out of us and I think this is great and I think that we should initiate uh, programs of this nature probably within our school system uh, as early as uh, kindergarten and all the way up through high school. I think that that would be a great stress reliever for, for a lot of people. I haven't, but uh, my wife did, and uh, oh. I just realized this when you asked me earlier, I said I don't think so, but then it came to me that she had told me that mm -hmm. uh, that. Uh, my wife did tell me that somebody from your community had uh, was offering, uh, I guess, a free class or something to the students at Los Niños, and that she had tried it, and some of the other teachers had tried it, and that they were real impressed, and that it was real, real relaxing and real, a big stress uh, uh, reliever. Yeah. Yes, as a matter of fact, uh, like uh, one of your the members of your community offered free courses or classes in yoga to. Uh, to uh, my wife's class at the kindergarten center, which is Los Niños Kindergarten Center. And uh, my wife and several of the teachers also uh, uh, participated in, in, the, uh, in, the, in the techniques of, of yoga. And, and I know that it, uh, they were all very happy and satisfied because uh, this was something that was really uh, great for, for not just the staff, but also for the students. And it was teaching them how to relax and how to, uh, how to be able to deal with stress, even at that young uh, age level. So I think this is great.